Hello and welcome back to Mass Effect starring Katrina Cat Shepard. We just met with the council and the council felt that the testimony of one traumatized dock worker who just out of thin air pulled up the name of a Turian Spectre named Saren and accused him of murdering Nihilus. They wouldn't believe that. But my guess is they will believe a completely forged audio tape and they'll find a completely forged audio tape to be irrefutable evidence. So that's what we're looking for is we're looking for evidence to to get Saren kicked out of the specters. And to do that, we got to go meet with some drunk a guy named Harkin. So we're going to go find Harkin. Well, actually, we need to find Garrus. Garrus might be able to help us out. The only reason we're going to look for Harkin is to find Garrus. Because apparently Garrus has an unlisted phone number and nobody knows what his email address is. And if we went and talked to the executor, the executor wouldn't tell us anything. And no other CSEC officer knows where Garrus is. Only Harkin apparently knows where Garrus is. It's totally whack. Completely whack. That guy's up to something. What guy? The one over by the keeper. What is this dude up to? What are you up to, man? What? Oh, n no, I wasn't. Never mind. Um, yes, I is there something you want? Why are you so interested in the keepers? Keepers? I've got no interest in the keep. Don't get coy. I know what I saw. I, uh, I'm not so sure I should be talking to you about this. We're just talking. Is there something wrong with that? No. <laughs> I guess it wouldn't hurt to tell you. She's I'm so using threatening. a small scanner to gather readings on the keepers. So far I've had mixed results. I find it difficult to get near the creatures. Why were you being so secretive about it, though? Well, technically we're not supposed to disturb the keepers. I don't really think my scanning disturbs them, but the authorities might disagree. I'd like to do it more openly, but it's not really worth getting arrested over. I'm going. So long. Yeah, she's not gonna. If the authorities don't want people doing that. She's like, okay, I won't do it. She follows the rules. Where should we go? Well, obviously we want to go down to. I mean, the only th the only ward location we have right now uh, is Cora's Den, but I don't think I want to go right there. I think I want to go through CSEC. So, let's go that way. And I don't want to do the big stupid jellyfish thing. <clears throat> yeah, I don't want to do with, deal with the big stupid jellyfish. Because I'm not sure how to play it out, quite frankly, for this shepherd. We are going to go to the wards through CSEC. I mean, we could go through the ward's axis, but I want to meet with Jaleed. How you holding up, Lieutenant? Not too bad. No headaches worth mentioning lately. Maybe I'm getting used to the strain. Maybe you've just got a good stress release. I know that knocking the geth on their synthetic asses gets rid of my headaches. So that's what you do, huh? You get a headache, you go find Geth to beat up, huh? Do 
make sure we get this on to our rapid transit system thing. All right, let's go. Or no, let's not do that yet. We will put that together with another quest. Oh, wait a minute. I'm going the wrong elevator. In light of the Crap. recent attack on Eden Prime, many colonial investors are pulling their support for oh, future rats. projects. Proponents of expanded human colonization insist that Eden Prime was an isolated case. Nevertheless, colonist enrollment has dropped sharply. This is the many wrong colonial elevator. Many proposals are on hold until backers have some reassurance that human colonies will be adequately protected. I want to go up to the Normandy. We can't even get into the Normandy right now. like what D closed for maintenance or something although Shepard's the exe executive officer she should be able to get into the Normandy sorry commander nobody's allowed on the Normandy right now doing some routine maintenance yeah but I'm the executive officer I need to oversee the maintenance crew man you're not gonna let me on my own ship A Solarian excavation team has run into an unexpected problem after unearthing a Prothean dig site. Hanar protesters have blockaded the dig site, claiming that artifacts of the Enkindlers, as the Hanar call them, should not be disturbed. The excavation team has appealed to Hanar representatives on the Citadel to reach a diplomatic solution. Let's take the right elevator this time. All right. Oh, and somebody wanted to see this on, or, or it's interested in seeing insanity. So we're gonna put it on insanity. There. Another elevator ride. Binary Helix has settled out of court with a Krogan group that had accused the Genetics Corporation of fraud. The Krogan group had contracted Binary Helix to perform studies with a long-range goal of curing their genetic sterilization. The group later sued for a return of investment money when the study produced no viable results. See, here's a CSEC officer right here. Why can't we just ask him where Garrus is? Hey, I know you. You're Shepard, right? I was on Mindwar during the Blitz. Saw you on the vids when you got your medal. You saved the whole colony. Looks like you have a fan. I'm sorry. I just never thought I'd meet someone like you in person. Uh, my name's Lang. Officer Eddie Lang, Citadel Security. It's an honor to meet you, Commander. What are you doing down here in the wards? Anything I can help you with? Wait a minute, you were on Mindwar during the Blitz? The Blitz took place, I think, one or two years before the massacre? The Thresher Maw massacre? What were you doing on Mindwar? Couldn't have been part of the same team that got massacred. Hmm. Um, 
Oh, no, wait a minute. Mindwar, no. Where's the Thresher Maw thing? I forget. Mindwar is where the the pirates came in. So you didn't save anybody from those pirates, huh? Oh, no, no, wait a minute. That would have been earlier. Okay. Uh, let's see. Do you know a CSEC officer named Harkin? I shouldn't really say too much. He's been on the force a lot longer than me. But I've heard things, you know? Drinking on the job, taking bribes, that kind of thing. Rumors mostly, but they suspended him, so some of it must be true. But where is he? That's all I want to know. Well, actually, I don't even give a crap where he is. I want to know where Garrus is. How come one of my investigate options isn't Garrus? <laughs> Why'd you join Citadel Security? I don't know. Seemed like the right thing to do, you know? Maybe it's in my blood. My grandfather was a cop back on Earth. It's kind of what CSEC is. Police for the Citadel. I'm still pretty new at it, but I like it so far. Way more interesting than staying back on Earth. You get to meet all kinds of cool aliens. Like those Hanar. Wild. Plus, CSEC gets a lot of respect here. We uphold the law. People, even aliens, appreciate that. Oh yeah, Akuz is where the Thresher Maw attack happened. Mindwar is the colony where a possible shepherd grew up. How do you like working here on the Citadel? This place is amazing. I've been here almost a year, and I still haven't seen a tenth of it. The Presidium's just so beautiful. Good place to go and relax. But I really like it here down in the wards. There's always something going on somewhere. Like that new club they just opened a few months ago, Flux. Wicked scene in there, Commander. You should check it out when you have some time. What do you know about Spectres? Just the stuff they show in the vids. They always make them out to be super agents on secret missions to save the galaxy. I know it's not really like that, though. Some of the other CSEC guys don't like them too much, figure they shouldn't be able to operate outside the law. But if they were so bad, the Council wouldn't use them, right? I have to go. Right. You're probably real busy. Well, see you around, Commander. That your professional opinion, sir? This isn't a station, it's a city. There must be millions here. It can't be possible to track everyone coming and going. This makes Jump Zero look like a portage on, and it's the largest deep space station the Alliance has. Jump Zero is big, but this is a whole nother scale. Look at the ward arms. How do they keep all that mass from flying apart? The Council represents more races than I thought. No wonder they're careful with newcomers. They probably just want to keep everything running. It has to be hard keeping all these cultures working together. Or maybe they just don't like humans. Why not? We've got oceans, beautiful women, this emotion called love. According to the old vids, we have everything they want. When you put it that way, there's no reason they wouldn't like you. I mean, us. Humans, man. Look at Ashley's look. You don't take much shore leave, do you, LT? <laughs> yeah. All right, laugh it up, Chief. I appreciate the thought, Alenka, but we're on duty here. Uh, aye, aye, ma'am. I'll walk drag, ma'am. <laughs> I had to go find out what that meant. I didn't know what that meant. It meant take the uh, trailing position in a patrol so she would. She's basically saying, I'll walk behind you guys and let you guys flirt. Yeah. Commander Shepard? Excuse me, Commander Shepard! I'm Emily Wong. I'm an investigative journalist working here on the Citadel. Could I have a moment of your time? What do you need? I've been hunting for evidence of corruption and organized crime on the Citadel, but there are places I can't go. I was hoping you might share anything you find during your own investigation. I can make it worth your time. How do you know I'm investigating anything here on the Citadel? I'm a good journalist, Commander Shepard. 
Word gets around. You gotta have access to better sources. Why contact me? I'm using every source I can find, but I think I've got a better shot with you. I've read your file. If anyone is going to uncover corruption here, it's the hero of the Skillian Blitz. How do you know that my investigation is gonna uncover anything you need? You wouldn't be investigating if it weren't big. And if it's big, it's something I'd like to hear about. No promises, but if I find anything relating to your case, I'll inform you. Thank you, Commander. You won't regret it. Well, Eddie Lang told us to go check out Flux. Let's go check it out. You should be careful who you say that around. What? Everyone knows Fist is in with the local criminals. Maybe, but I wouldn't go shouting it from the mountaintops. Yeah, unless you want to end up on his hit list. Yes, I heard he actually buried some corpses under the stage at Cora's Den. I wouldn't put it past him. Yes, and it might explain the stench in that place. It's out of my hands, Rita. I'd bring her back in a second, but she doesn't want to come. Ugh, I know, I know. I'll see if I can talk some sense into her next time I see her. Be careful. You know how stubborn your sister can be. The more you push and prod, the more she'll run away. Yeah, you're probably right. Thanks, Doran. Sorry, I'm kind of busy right now. So, uh, what can I do for you? What were you discussing with the Volus? Who, Doran? Oh, uh, I was just asking him about my sister. See, she worked for Doran before she left to... Ugh, sorry. I don't want to bore you with my problems. I'm interested to hear what you have to say. Well, okay. My sister Jenna left here to go work at Cora's Den. The problem is, she's working as an informant for CSEC. You know, eavesdropping on the people there. If they find out what she's doing, they'll kill her. Being an informant is a dangerous job. That's what I've been telling her. Mm, I don't know. Sometimes I think she stays there just to spite me. Do you know who her contact at CSEC is? Mm, no. It's all very secret. Last time I asked an officer, he told me to stay out of it. For Jenna's safety. Maybe I could help her understand just how dangerous Cora's Dan is. Would you? That'd be great. Just don't tell her I sent you. Well, I should get back to work before I get in trouble. <laughs> Thanks. Okay. Yeah, my last playthrough I didn't do Jenna's quest. And so Conrad ended up dead in Mass Effect 3. Because Jenna wasn't there to sabotage the dude's gun. My goodness. Generally, it's better to take rapid transit around the Citadel because you're going to end up in loading screens anyway. I don't think you bought this here. I don't sell this model. Look, I know it was you. I remember your face. Really? That's impressive. Usually, you humans can't tell one Turian from another. This was the place. Now, are you going to give me a refund or not? Do you have your proof of purchase? What? No, no, I, I, I don't think you ever gave me one. I'm sorry, Ben. I can't help you. But what, what do you... Can't help you. I need an Elkos license. Hello, Earth Clan. No doubt you've just come back from the colonies. Will you be needing supplies? What colonies are you talking about? Oh, my mistake, Earth Clan. I assumed it doesn't matter. Pharos? Novaria? Well, if you haven't heard of them yet, I'm sure you will soon. But it doesn't matter where you hail from. My goods are available to all. What can you tell me about Novaria? 
the corporate capital of the Attican Traverse. Very cold, very snowy. I don't get too many clients from there. They all have their own private suppliers. I'd like to know more about Pharos. It's an old Prothean world. Their buildings still litter the surface. The humans aren't the first to colonize it, but they are the most recent. Hmm. I just realized I haven't heard from my contact on that planet for some time. Ah, well, I'm sure he's fine. Nah. Probably been taken over by some plant. Show me what you've got. Most excellent. I am sure you will find something pleasing. <laughs> okay, I need that. And I'll go ahead and buy that too. Is that really... Oh, wow! It's you! You're Commander Shepard! The hero of Eden Prime! I am so honored to meet you. Nice to meet you. And you are? My name is Conrad. Conrad Werner. They say you killed more than a hundred Geth on Eden Prime. I spent most of my time trying to stay alive and help the colonists. Hey, I know you're probably busy, but um, do you have time for a quick autograph? Anything for a fan. Here. Thanks. I really appreciate it. My wife is going to be so impressed. I'll let you get back to work. Oh, but next time you're on Earth, I'd love to buy you a drink. Thanks again. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, that's enough for this episode. Next episode, we'll get down to Kor's Dan and talk with Harkin. And actually, we have to talk with Jenna's sister. And we have to talk to General Raka. We've got a bunch of stuff to do down there. But until then, have a nice day.